Hello, Pirate Nation. Well, here at Pirate Headquarters, the halls are pretty bare, and it would be an understatement to say that we miss our students sorely. We hope you're all safe out there, following the instructions of your leaders and family, and making sure that we can make this pandemic go away as fast as possible. However, pirates have been through pandemics before, and they've survived quite well. We are specifically designed to deal with these sorts of challenges. And so right now, your teachers, some of the best in the state, are working hard to put together lessons that will work during this time where we cannot be together. I encourage you to pay attention to your email because that's how we're communicating with all of our students. And then if you have questions, feel free to give us a call here at school. Mrs. McPhail and I are always here. Or you can email us or call whenever you get a chance if you just want to talk to somebody. Oh, look, there's somebody in the hall right now, Mrs. Dunton. Hi. <laughs> hey, everybody. Hope you're doing, uh, doing well at home, doing, staying healthy, and uh, getting your work done. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing you back here real soon. We miss you. Exactly. So be safe, be well. We'll see you real soon. Stay posted on our email and website. See you later. Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Pollock with JMG. Please know that I'm thinking of you and your families. I hope that you are all happy and healthy. To my JMG students, I miss you so much. Please make sure that you guys are checking in with one another. We will get through this together and I look forward to seeing you soon. Hi everyone, how you doing? I'm working here in my home office in the sunroom of my house and uh, just learning how to learn this different way and how to teach this different way. Hope you're having a good weekend. Hi folks. It's Mrs. Cleves and Tate. We're just going to tell you that we miss you. We miss the fifth graders especially. We miss our PCES and PCMS family. And we hope that it's not long before we're all back together again. Until then, stay positive and take care of one another. See you soon. Hello, second graders. I hope all is well with you and your families. While we're away from school, you should go outside and play or take a walk or just go out and check out the, all the cool sounds and the beauty that the state of Maine has to offer. Um, we're so fortunate to live in the state of Maine. Don't forget your learning packet. Um, Mom and Dad can help you with that, um, but I, I do think most of it you can do independently. I believe in you. Um, uh, also, don't forget to take brain breaks. You know, you can uh, exercise, jumping jacks, do some push-ups, dead bugs, go noodle, freeze dance, anything like that. Play with your brothers and sisters. Um, and then read, read, read. I think reading is probably the most important part of school that we need to continue to do even though we're not here. And remember to wash your hands often. Um, remember to cover your coughs and sneezes. And <clears throat> be a PDI agent, like we learned in health. Protect, don't infect. Um, I miss you all and hope to see you real soon. Um, take care. Be helpful while you're at home, too. I'm sure there's a lot of things you could do to help, mom and, help with mom and dad. Take care, and I hope to see you real soon. Bye-bye. Hi, this is Mrs. Jarrett, and this is my dog, Mia. Um, I just wanted to take this opportunity to say hi, to let you know that I was thinking about you. Um, I hope everything is going all right. Stay safe, stay healthy, and just know that we are thinking about you and all the members of the SAD4 community. Um, hope uh, we will be back together again soon. Hello, SAD4 families and friends, and all those students out there surviving with their parents teaching them. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're all staying healthy. I'm talking to you from my makeshift office here at home. I've taken over the grandchildren's room. They're not really liking it. I hope everybody's getting outside and enjoying some of this nice sunshine. And don't forget, always read i'm rereading this i've read it three times this is my fourth time you can always reread a book and i hope to see you all real soon i'm really missing all of you 
I'm missing saying don't run in the hallways or please sit down. I'm really missing all of that. Thank you. Have a great week. Hey guys. I just want you to know that I'm really missing you and I'm missing our time together in the classroom. Hi everyone. I wanted to let you know that I miss you and I've been thinking of you. I hope everything's going well. You're healthy. You're playing outside. You're doing lots of learning. Please know that you can reach me on email or Seesaw. And I will look forward to hearing from you. Hey friends. This is Larson here. Checking in to see how you're doing. Hope you're well. Can't wait until we can see each other again. Hey guys. I wanted to let you know I'm thinking of you and I miss you. I hope you're doing fine. I'm sitting at home, um, just like you're sitting at home doing your things. I'm helping to do them from my home as well. If you need help, you have a question, or you just want to say hi, I want you to know that I'm here for you. I'm available online all day. Send me an email, message me on Seesaw. Um, I'll be giving you a call later again this week. Keep up your great work. Go out on an adventure. Explore. Give yourself a great big hug from me, and I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, everybody. Um, welcome to week two of our time apart. I wanted to say hi and that I really miss everybody. And if you haven't had a chance, connect to our Google Classrooms or check in with our school websites. Um, if you are catching up with your work, then please take some time to play outside, spend time with your family. The biggest thing I hope for is that you all stay safe and well, and that in before we know it, we'll all be back together again. So I hope to see you soon. Good morning, everyone. I'm here with Jelly, my cat. I just want to wish you guys a great day. Um, I miss you. I'm enjoying reading a lot of my fifth graders writing and uh, their journaling. And you can expect to be hearing from me quite a lot. Jelly is really loving my phone right now. Get outside, go for a walk, play some games, be nice to your parents. Uh, and if you need me, give me a call. I'm here. You can email me. Uh, some of you, I think, have my number. And we'll get through this, guys. Take care of yourselves. And take care of your parents. Bye. Hi, friends. It's Mrs. Bell. I just wanted to tell you I miss you so much, and I love you bunches. I hope you're having a good week. Send me an email. Give me a call. Just get in touch, please. I miss you. Okay, don't forget to read your books and study your math facts. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Hi, guys. I hope you're um, getting a lot of work done while you're at home and uh, staying safe. And uh, we just want to know that I, I really miss you guys. And uh, we're hoping that this is over with soon and that we're back to our normal operations of going to school. But in the meantime, just do your best. And uh, if you're doing any artwork, try to send it in. I just did my self-portrait. What do you think? Mm. Hello everybody, Miss Dunton here. Um, just wanted to drop you a note and say hello, let you know I'm thinking about you. Sad Four certainly is empty without you. Um, just doing a lot of work to make sure families have the technology they need, make sure teachers have the support that they need to do the technology. Do a good job with your work, listen to your parents, uh, your caregivers, uh, ask us questions if you have them, and we'll try to help out wherever uh, wherever we can and we're looking forward to having you back just as soon as uh, just as soon as we can have a great day hey second grade i just wanted to say how i miss you all so so much i think of you guys every single day i hope you're staying safe you're staying healthy and you're keeping up with your schoolwork. i can't wait till i can see you guys again hi guys it's miss arno just saying hello i miss you all and i can't wait to get back and see you Hope you're getting outside and enjoying the weather. Um, hopefully sooner than later we'll be back. Take care and be good to your parents. And I'll be right here to teach you your tricky words when we get back. Thank you. Miss you all. Good morning, everybody. I hope you all are doing good. Hoping you all are staying healthy and doing what you can to get done, everything done. Um, just checking in with everybody, seeing if anybody needs anything, um, needs to talk. Mrs. Wright created an online form that I'm sure we'll have a link to um, that if you guys fill out, I will get in touch with you as soon as I see it and we'll find a way to communicate. Again, I hope everybody's doing great, um, staying safe, and uh, do the best that you can. All right. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye. Hi, everyone. 
This is Mrs. McFadden. I miss seeing all of you in the halls, the cafeterias, the classrooms, but we're making lemonade out of lemons. We've been working really hard to keep the schools clean, get the food out to you, and schoolwork from your teachers so you don't fall too far behind in your routine. So enjoy this time at home with your families. Have some fun outside in the fresh air while continuing to wash those hands and practice social distancing. Hey, we miss you terribly, and we can't wait for you to return to school. Hey, everybody. This is Mrs. Collette. Um, I want to say hello, and I hope you're all safe and washing your hands. I hope you're all reading a little bit every day and practicing a little bit of math. And I wanted to introduce you to the new addition to my family. This is Lola, and she's 11 weeks old. I hope to see you all very soon. Hi, fourth grade. I miss you dearly. I hope you're having a good time at home with your parents and I hope you're doing your lessons. I'm hoping you're working as hard as I am. I am all learning all kinds of new apps and programs to help you so that we can video chat and I can help you do all kinds of uh, different things when while we're apart. I want you to stay strong, stay healthy, and know that I think about you all the time. I miss every one of you, and we will be together again soon. Stay strong. I'm proud to be the principal of our wonderful school. It seems strange to be here without all of you, but I know your teachers are working hard to help you learn from home, and I know you can. You are the pirates, and you have swagger. Be on the lookout for your school supplies. I'll be riding the bus to deliver them and I'll be at school to help hand them out. I miss seeing each and every one of you and I can't wait until you're back in the hallways and in the classrooms. In the meantime, try your hardest, help each other when you can and stay well. Hope to see you soon. Rise and shine everyone. It's Mrs. Cox here. I thought I might have a little fun while telling you all just how much I miss your faces and stories. Please work hard at working hard on your assignments. No excuses, just do your best. My assignment for each of you is to take time to get out in the fresh air for some exercise. Do some artwork, make some music, Use your math and science skills to create something delicious in the kitchen. But most of all, curl up with a good book for at least 15 minutes a day. You'll be surprised where it can take you. And who knows, maybe when we get back together, I can teach you how to make your own character animation. Think how fun those world history reports will be. See you soon. Bye. Hey guys, this is... Miss Curtis, math teacher here. We really miss you. This is certainly different. I hope that you are safe and well and happy. And this can be quite an interesting time of learning. I'm excited. I'm excited about all the regular math you're gonna discover right at your house, inside and outside. So perhaps you'll go into the kitchen only with someone's permission, right? Get out some of these measuring tools, make something, read a recipe, or just fill this with water or dirt. Figure out, huh, I wonder how many quarter cups will fit into, I don't know, a whole cup if you don't know. Which one's bigger? How do they fit in? All kinds of questions that you might have. If you're not busy cooking, maybe you like to build stuff. Once again, get that adult. Lots of measuring here, right? Build a bird house, build a bat house. Just even see how this thing works. Maybe you can bang some nails into a board. Take it out. It's a simple machine. Math and science and learning is all around you. If you can't do those things, how about a card game? Get out your deck of cards. There are so many things you can do with these. Put them in order, make subtraction problems. Can you make a thousand? with two three-digit numbers? Can you make the biggest difference, the smallest difference, whatever you have? 
And real Mainers, all Mainers know how to play cribbage. And if you want some more games and videos, go to my website and they'll teach you how to play 99, 21, 31. Do it up, Jenga, build, build, build. And how about make your own puzzle? I've started one here. Don't uh, make fun of my triangles. But I can make this super cool design. I can color it in lots of different ways. And then I'm gonna take my scissors, right? I cut this up any way I want. I don't let my dog, because he's the only one home with me, see this. But I've basically made my own puzzle. And I give it to somebody, oop, a little more, in my family, and they can put it back together. Okay? So if you don't get it, I want you to have fun. Learning is fun. Take care. Hi everybody, happy spring. I hope that you're all doing well, enjoying the nicer weather that has come our way. Um, I miss you all and I look forward to seeing you all again soon, but in the meantime, let's stay positive and let's enjoy this new adventure in distance learning. See you soon. Good morning, SAD4 students and families. I want you to know how much I miss seeing all of you in the halls. I can't wait till we're back together again. I hope you're using this time to not only work through your schoolwork, but to also have some fun with your families, and I hope you're getting outside and playing some games. Uh, this is a strange time for everybody, and we're all doing our best. I want you to remember that even though you don't see your teachers every day, we are all still here for you, and we all miss you. Hope to see you soon. Hi, friends and family. This is Mrs. Pansiera. I'm coming to you from my home. I uh, just want to say hi to my pre-K students because it's been a couple of weeks since we've seen each other and we didn't get to say see you later. So I just want to give you a hi now. Um, I hope you guys are out there creating, exploring, playing, and learning. I also want to say thank you to the families for helping continue their child's education at home. Um, again, if you guys have any needs, any questions, we're here to help you. Um, so please stay connected if you can and we'll get through this together. Bye. I'm PCHS Pirates. I'm taking a recess break right now with Princess Leia. We wanted to show you what our world looks like on this beautiful day. My thoughts are with you and your families every day during this adjustment time. Things are ever changing and believe me, no one has all the answers, so we must be flexible. My biggest wish is for you to take care of yourselves. Do something fun every day. Some things that I would recommend are having family dinners. Have a game night, watch movies, go for a walk, hang out with a furry friend. Most importantly, reach out to your friends. Those virtual connections are important, not only to you, but to everyone else as well. I miss the excitement and connections with all of you. I would love to know what you've been doing since I saw you last. Please reach out to me with any questions, concerns, or just to say hi. I am here to help you and your friends and your families in any way that I can. Hi, first graders. Me, Mrs. Polkinen, and Mrs. Hall, we all miss you so much. We hope you are having a good break with your family, having lots of family time, and maybe even getting a little bit of time outside. I'm about to go snowshoeing and enjoy the nice sunny day. We will see you soon, and we miss you all so, so much. Hey, everyone. First of all, I wanna say I miss you all. Um, it's hard for me to do my job, which is keeping you guys safe and healthy if we're not in school. Um, I especially miss my regulars, whether you come down every day to see me for medical reasons or whether you're just trying to skip classes. Um, you know who those of you are. Um, I do miss seeing your smiling faces. I miss interaction, acting with you. Um, it's just these are strange times, but we will get through them, and then when we get back to classes again, I'll catch up with you. Uh, just to remind you all that it is allergy season for those of you who suffer from allergies this is the time of year i would be reminding teachers that you guys are going to be coughing sneezing blowing your nose rubbing your eyes downright miserable um, if you want to use the website that i use to track allergy season and see when the pollen count is high and low right now it is at a low medium it's in the green zone uh, that changes daily it's called the pollen people p-o-l-l-e-n people 
um, I get a daily email that tells me not only what the um, average uh, rate of allergies are, but also what the pollens are. Today, for example, is uh, maple trees and juniper trees. Um, so something to check out. Be well, be healthy, get lots of sleep, eat well, um, get your exercise, and continue to wash your hands. See you soon, I hope. Bye.